Hello everyone and welcome to the next episode of Let's Play Deus Ex Invisible War. Ah, today we are getting started in Cairo, the next big hub area, kind of like Seattle was the first one. South Medina, let's go. I think we'll do the exterior in the South Medina and the Nassif Greenhouse in this segment. And let's start off by- I was unable to locate Cairo International Airport. This small landing pad was the closest I could come to the city center. Why'd you expect to find an international airport? According to my map, there should be an airport 22 kilometers northeast of central Cairo. Instead, that seems to be the site of a landfill. There hasn't been commercial air travel since the collapse 20 years ago. Perhaps my navigation database is out of date. I'm talking about the collapse, the biggest depression in world history. I guess you don't follow current events. Of course I know about the collapse. If I fail to find the passenger I'm looking for, I'll be available to take you to another destination. If so, we'll leave from this landing pad. Let's keep chatting with Ava. You can't hear her, and I don't know if you can read. She just said, I have work to do in Cairo. Perhaps I can be of assistance later. I will remain with my craft. And she starts repeating herself. So with her done, let's check things out. There's a multi-tool on the railing here in the northeast corner. Let's check these boxes right quick. Assuming I can get Alex to settle down and... I'm trying to get to that little overlook right there. I'm pretty sure I need... Uh... Once again, good work in Seattle. The WTO is making good use of the data. Your next objective, destroy the Nassif family's greenhouse, which is in the northwest corner of the South Medina. The experimental greenhouse, a violation of WTO regulations, should lead us to Dr. Nassif. Nassif greenhouse, destroy. I'm certainly not about to destroy it. I haven't seen you before. Welcome to our small Medina. Hi, name's Alex. Pardon the simplicity of this drawing, but I like to give newcomers a map so they can find their way around. The local business owners are always complaining that they don't get enough foot traffic. Thanks, that's very thoughtful. Map Medina stored in data vault. There were some murders here last night. It's only fair that I warn you. I'm Ali Baran, president of business development. Under any other circumstances, I would show you around. The victims were the parents of Leila Nassif. This was a deliberate assassination carried out by paramilitary. The event happened in the greenhouse, where Leila and her parents were hiding. No one knows who the killers were or what they wanted. The assumption is that Layla got away. We never found her body. Perhaps this means nothing to you, but Layla is a hero around here. She is the one who funded the greenhouse. Layla was the first of us scouts to go to the Tarsus Academy of Arcology. Even when her job took her to America, Layla never turned her back on the Medina. The Nassif greenhouse is already producing food, clean, affordable vegetables. I hope you enjoy your visit. Good day, sir. I enjoyed our chat. Even when her job took okay, her he's back, done. Layla never turned her back on her. Just taking a break. Actually, I'm looking for work. I can't find a job in the Medina, and I can't get a work pass for the oncology. At least there's always quick quicks. Listen to me. I'm sure you have more important things to do today. At least there's always quick quicks. All right, she's done. Let's talk to the SSC guard. Stand back, SSC on duty. Got to keep walking the same crappy beat. Never mess around with the boss's son, or else you end up with an assignment like this. Sand everywhere. Ugh. And this haze. Oh well. Oh well. Okay. 
We can't get into the arcology yet, but there's the door. Just as a heads up. Let's go ahead and talk to the Queequeg's manager. Well, someone new in the Medina. Don't worry about catching the plague at my little coffee stand. We are a high priority zone for the bots, and we sterilize our equipment with infrasound. That's good to hear. People come to the old city to find the black market. Is that why you risk getting infected? Security must be pretty non-existent around here. Is there a lot of crime? Not my concern. There is always strife. I asked because I can make a deal for someone who could get into the new Cairo Arcology and do Queequegs a favor. I'm listening. The regional director has been disappointed in my profits since the intensification of Nanite Swell 11. I lose the shop if I can't find a way to impress him. What am I supposed to do? NG Residence is playing a concert in the Arcology tomorrow. I need someone to convince her to endorse Queequegs. From what I hear, her manager, Miss Withers, can easily be bribed. Try to catch her waiting for NG and offer her some money. If she accepts, I will compensate you with a choice of several weapon mods, which I found on a dead Omar. Miss Withers, huh? I'll let you know if I run into her. Alright, let's look at our goals. We have two now. WTO, destroy the greenhouse owned by Dr. Leila Nassif's uncle. It is in violation of WTO food production regulations. The greenhouse can be found in the northwest corner of the South Medina. Queequegs. Coffee Wars, bribe NG's manager. Queequegs. Find NG's manager on Arcology level 110 and bribe her to have NG become the exclusive spokeswoman for Queequegs. The coffee shop manager has offered you a choice of several weapon mods in return. I need a miracle to save my job. Please find a way to get that NG endorsement. I'll let you know how it goes. I need a miracle okay. to I'll let you know. He's repeating himself, so let's get the food off the table. Look how far we've regressed. That's all there is. There's nothing over here except maybe a way back up. No. I bet this sign that says helipad is a good way up, though. Let's try that. Oh, yes. Perhaps I should volunteer at the church. Good. Oh, oh, Alex, you're killing me, man. Alright. Let's try it again. I doubt he can climb the ladder with this in his hands. Oh, I guess he can. Well, that's good. Alex, 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 you're killing me. Alright, let's try this again. Excellent, made it. If I can just get in here. This is worth a quick save, right here. Just in case I fall. Try to overlook your betrayal at the Mako facility if you help us find Dr. Nassif. She comes from a poor family in this plague stricken village. Billy Adams will be coordinating the investigation from the mosque that lies between the arcology and the village. Report to her at once. Goal received. Report to Billy. Order. Report to Billy Adams in the mosque that separates the Arcology from the Medina. That's pretty straightforward. Sniper rifle and binoculars up here, neither of which I really have any use for. Let's keep going through here for now. Gold beams, you may remember. They'll kill me if I step into them, but... Good old electrostatic discharge means beams are always a non-issue. Alright, let's head through here. See what we can find. There's an EMP converter mod on the bench, a combat knife, and another piece of bread on the table. Over in the basket, we have two ammo clips and a spider bomb. That's all pretty handy. And with that, we should be set to return to the helipad. That is a map change to North Medina, which I don't want to mess with yet. 
Instead... How are you? Hi. Let's check the top level up here before I do anything else. Pilot beacon. I can turn on or off. Binoculars on the railing. And a data cube. Come to work in the arcology. Fusing architecture and ecology, these WTO-constructed cities provide easy pedestrian access to all work, living, and recreational spaces inside the safety of our atmospheric barriers. None of the waste, sprawl, and inconvenience of pre-collapse urban spaces. All the convenience and luxury you deserve. Get your work pass and start your future today. Alright. There's another data cube on the table. Maintenance receipt. Pilot Beacon RK4 Routine Service. Inspection failed. Air traffic must cease immediately. Firmware upgrade. Refused. Account shows a balance. WTO Symmetriad 6-month license. Expired. Contact our office at once. Excuse me. On top of the locker, there's an energy cell. What's inside the locker? It takes two multi-tools to get in. Not sure it's worth it, we'll find out. A med kit and a stun prod. Two multi-tools for that? No thanks, let's reload. <coughs> Excuse me. Yes, I decided that's definitely not worth it. And I also realized I never looked at my Medina map. There it is. Map. Medina. Landing pad. Queequeg's Coffee. Under landing pad. To the east. Elevator to... Or, I'm sorry. To the north. Elevator to the Arcology. Northwest. Entrance to Greenhouse. Through... Th this is through the map change, obviously, but... In the south Medina, we find the entrance to the mosque. Order. Recruitment area. And old Cairo apartments. Anyway, not a whole lot going on. Good to see you. So let's go down these ladders, back down to ground level. Let's check out the Arcology entrance before we head to the greenhouse. I'm not going to blow it up, by the way. I'm siding with the order at this juncture, but let's check things out in here. The Arcology, three multi-tools, or key code required, and there's a guard. Well, Arcology Miniature. It's just a little pyramid, looks like. Data Cube. Uh, come to work in the Arcology, we've already read. There's a can of soda on her desk. You don't want to get yourself in trouble now. An ammo clip on her desk. Inside the locker looks like two concussion grenades, which I don't need to spend two multi-tools to get. Let's talk to the guard. I have to see your Arcology Pass before I can let you in. I don't have one. How do I get one? If you don't already have one, then you're probably not supposed to have one. But there might be a compromise. Such as? There are those in the Medina who might get you a pass for a price, but really all they're looking for are mercenaries to do their dirty work. Me? I just want to help people out. Give me a few credits for my trouble and I'll act like you've got a pass. No thanks. No thanks. I'll find another way to get in. Okay. Let's roll out now. These guys, I th think, are about to I'll mess try with it me. again and again to get accepted into our college. I guess I do not have the right pedigree to live with you rich types. My daughter is always sick. We are people just like you. I guess I do not have the right pedigree to live with you rich types. We're sick of you arcology types coming out here, pointing and laughing like this is a theme park or a zoo. I'm not sightseeing. I have business here. We have no choice but to stay here. We don't get to go back inside your atmospheric barriers at the end of the day. I don't live in the arcology. Our children can't sleep at night because they can't breathe this filth. But that's about to change. You look like you've got more than enough credits to buy breeders for our families. 
Don't worry, your children are about to inherit your breathers. What a fool! I don't take kindly to robbery attempts, whether they need the money or not. If they asked nicely instead of threatening me, I probably would have given it to them. So here's the map change to the greenhouse. Let me check that side passage real quick before I commit to that. All right, let's head into the greenhouse. Oh, goodness. Nasif greenhouse. There are several ways to put an end to the Nasif family's illegal food production. Destroying the filter system will kill the plants, or you can destroy them directly. You can also reprogram the software that automates the greenhouse. Goal received. Nasif greenhouse. Destroy. Destroy the Nasif greenhouse by blowing up the hydro filter system or reprogramming the software that automates the greenhouse. We want to disable the turret first, if we can. Here comes a security bot. Alright. That's all handled now. So here we have hydroponics, here we have the Nasif warehouse. Before we do any of that, security computer. All right, let's get out of here. Let's head into the warehouse first. Looks like a couple of concussion grenades over here. <coughs> Hydroponics air filtration. There's a spider bomb right there. I don't really see anything else. Uh, let's head up this ladder. That does seem like a good idea. Up here we find a phosphorus flare, a multi-tool, and an energy cell. Looks like 20 is my limit on a multi-tool stack, which is fine. Another computer. Let's disable the beams, disable the bot, wherever it is. And... Ah yes, there are the beams. Hydroponics control system. Before we head there, let's check the message at the desk. Close the place down and go home. Whoever came after my niece and murdered our technicians is still looking for her. I came back to my apartment for my parental pass so that I could check up on my daughter at the Tarsa school. But the headmaster assures me that she's safe. We're still debating whether to go anyway. Don't return to work until you hear from me personally. We were hoping you would run into Dr. Nassif's uncle here, but it looks like he's one step ahead of us. After you destroy the hydroponics, why don't you pay him a visit? His apartment is on the second floor of a building across the square from the Order Church. Goal received. Dr. Nasif investigate uncle. WTO, search the apartment of Dr. Nasif's uncle for clues to her whereabouts. 
He lives on the second floor of the Medina apartments in the North Medina. Close the place down and go home. That's it for him. I came after my niece and murder dog technicians is still looking for her. I came back to my apartment for my parental pass so that I could check up on the over here. The school. But the headmaster assures me that she's safe. I'm still debating whether to go anyway. Don't return to work until you hear from me personally. I don't see any other vents, so let's head for that one if we can. Like I'm under the stairs I saw earlier. Back here, there's an SMG and two ammo clips. Ah, uh, useless. Let's head back into there. And let's head up to the hydroponics control system. That's a med bot. Medical equipment on board. Fragile. Got a camera over there. What's over here? Another courtyard overlook. We've got bread, a flash bomb, a bottle of wine, another pair of binoculars out on this balcony. Let's let's head into this door right here. Data cube. Greenhouse security login. We're having trouble with vandals again. I don't think this is just kids causing trouble. I think it's the WTO. Well, if they think they can muscle me out, they have another thing coming. I've hooked up a new security system. State of the art. Here are the codes. No one messes with Meskini Nasif and gets away with it. Login. Nasif Greenhouse Hydroponics Computer stored in Data Vault. Lotion. Soy. Shampoo. Combat knife. Bread. Bread. Bottle of wine. Inside the chest. Sniper rifle. And two ammo clips. Oh, goody. I'm gonna go deal with that camera right quick. Hydroponic security camera, blah, blah, blah. Oh my gosh, Alex, really? How incompetent are you? Let's try this again. Need you to hop over the railing and onto those beams I'm looking at. Can you do that? Yes! Good, good. <clears throat> if it's not obvious, I'm trying to get him over onto that wall because I spotted a vent up there, so I'm pretty sure that's a way we do want to go and mess with. So let's get him onto the edge. Let's get him onto these beams. Quick save again. And it just sucks because the more I have to quick load, the shorter my videos end up being because the more segments I have to divide them into thanks to the stupid way they did their load zones, the less I'm able to, uh, oh, come on, Alex, you can do it. I know you can. From here, come on, man, just get in there. Yes! All right. 
there anything up there? No, but let's head for that vent. Let's see what we can find. Hopefully something good. That was hard to get into. All right, looks like we've got a multi-tool. An ammo clip and a Hellfire Bolt Caster. That's uh, the third unique weapon. What's this one do? A black market accelerator that launches an incendiary bolt. Still useless. Uh, an ammo scavenger mod. That's handy. And doesn't really look like there's anything else. So, I guess I will head back out the way I came. Need him to get back to that balcony. I'll probably just end up looping through the warehouse again, but maybe he'll be not retarded. Nope. That's fine. Let's get back to where that alarm went off. I think there's a t I think there's going to be a turret gunning for me, so Let's hack into the computer. Turn the turret off. Make it ally with me. Turn off the camera. I'm not gonna terminate the greenhouse program. Let's go back and visit the med bot since I took some hits. Reassembling tissues. Finished repairing damage. And now let's roll down to the warehouse. If you do want to side with the WTO, you can shut things down there. Key code or two multi-tools required. Well, how about this instead? keep forgetting about the good old-fashioned direct route. Now this is the air filtration system. I could destroy this too. Got another, got a multi-tool and a pack of cigarettes in here. I don't really see anything else, but I don't want to dest I don't want to destroy the greenhouse. I guess I can't get into that passage unless I destroy the greenhouse, so I'll just have to skip that passage. Let's head into the actual hydroponics area. <laughs> I could trek back to the med bot, or I could just eat one piece of food. I think I can get those little jerks in one whack now. That's handy. And they haven't- they didn't explode. That's handy too. Another multi-tool there on the ground. More toxic gas. Explosive crates. Security bots. Hey, 
wait for the other one to turn around, and then I'll disable it, too. Let me go ahead and take out these lasers. Perfect. That didn't exactly accomplish anything. I'm not really finding anything down here. I don't want to destroy the plants directly either. Come on, Alex. Is there anything else out here? Looks like no. I'd like to get to that middle level, but I'm not quite sure how, except well, except to trek all the way back to the control computer and then just drop down from above. So I guess I'll go ahead and do that. Well, if Alex cooperates, I will do that. Once more, under the breach. I just... Mm, this kind of stuff frustrates me, and it's all over this game. Platforming in first-person games is a terrible thing. Developers never seem to learn that. Okay, we made it. Now, let's see what we can find. There's a multi-tool right here. And a vent over here. There's a multi-tool. <laughs> Let's get into the vent and see what we can find. I'm hoping that this is the one underneath the... filtration control. Let me make sure of that. Yes, very good. Don't have to blow it up to get down here. Good. Good, 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 good. Let's see what's in this room. Besides a rat. A biomod canister! And a concussion prox mine. All right, let's go ahead and take my strength enhancement to level three. Booyah. All right, my next black market canister will go into electrostatic discharge. I still have to decide what to do with my eye slot. Oh, I just don't know. Just don't know. I really don't need Spy Drone. So I guess, yeah, I'll go with Vision Enhancement. So I need three more standard canisters and one more Black Market canister. And my Alex will be maxed out. It happens very fast, but 
the game itself is also very short, so I guess it doesn't really matter that much. There's a med kit in there. In here, there are two energy cells. Up top, there's an energy blade. I am interested in none of it. Hmm. All right, let's get out of here. I'm not about to destroy the greenhouse. I like letting poor people eat. Stupid WTO. Alright, I'm gonna head through the map change to the North Medina, and then I think I will call this a video. Ooh, excuse me. Did I ever actually see what was up here? The answer, apparently, is nothing. Fair enough. Alright, let's head over toward the North Medina. How's it going? Hey. I should have known there was something back here. Looks like credits, a noisemaker grenade, and a phosphorus flare. Let's open it. Get my hundred credits. I'm not interested in any of the other stuff, but it's not like I have anything else to do with the multi-tools either. Alright, <clears throat> let's travel to the North Medina. And at this juncture, I think I'll go ahead and call it a video. So, as soon as we're through the load zone, time to update the quick save, make a new main save as we arrive at the North Medina. All right, this has been Let's Play Deus Ex Invisible War. Next time, we will tackle the North Medina. Until then, thanks for watching. Bye bye.